But we begin with Michiganders adjusting to the new mask rules for the first time in nearly a year. Some people are no longer required to mask up in public. In fact, the changes took effect this morning, marking a major shift in the pandemic. Michiganders who are fully vaccinated are no longer required to wear a mask indoors. People who are not vaccinated or haven't completed their doses must still wear a mask. If you're outside, masks are no longer required regardless of your vaccination status. But businesses may still require them, and many are, including Meyer, Target, CVS, and Walgreens. The policies are different at stores and restaurants across Metro Detroit, so you should check before you walk in the door. Larry Sproul live at Comerica Park for us tonight, where you no longer need to wear a mask at your seat. And Larry, we know some people were okay ditching the mask today and others weren't ready. And Steve and Sandra, we saw a lot of people downtown Detroit tonight without their mask on, and they were very happy not to do so. But we also saw some people that still had their mask on. They say they were not comfortable just yet with taking them off. But I got to be honest, it seemed like downtown Detroit was back to normal. The people were out here, businesses and restaurants were back open, and at the end of the day, they will have the final say so. Downtown Detroit looked like it did pre pandemic on a Saturday night. People are back. The mask mandate here in Michigan is now lifted. You do not have to wear a mask outside or inside if you are fully vaccinated. And it seems like people could not wait to hear that news. I feel comfortable that I've been vaccinated for over two months, but I also feel like it's up to every person and how they feel. <laughs> But Torian Thomas says he's not ready to get rid of his mask just yet. Well, I think uh, I'm completely vaccinated, but I think just to make other people feel safe and I want to be comfortable, so I keep wearing my mask. I don't mind it. But there's a kicker to the new mask rules. The state is leaving it totally up to restaurants or businesses to enforce wearing a mask or not. You know, our staff, we're going to we're going to require our staff to keep the masks on. But Sean Kachuba, the general manager of Moots Pizzeria in downtown Detroit, says they're allowing the customers to decide. But as a customer, you come in if you don't have one. That's your decision. If you have one, that's also your decision. Things are a little different in Ivy's Kitchen and Cocktails off East Jefferson in Detroit. So our policy is still to mask up. Naya Marshall, the owner, says it's all about safety. You will still be required to wear the mask when you enter and exit. Actually, when you move around in Ivy, you will still be required to wear the mask. And so I talked to about 11 other restaurants off camera tonight, and they say the same thing, that their answers were really split down the middle. Half of them say they were still going to require customers to wear a mask. The other ones say they will not do that, but their employees and their staff members will still be required to wear a mask. So very different answers, but people are still definitely talking about the new mask or lack of mask mandate orders. We are live at Comerica Park tonight. Larry Sproul, Local 4. Yeah, it really depends on where you go. Thank you, Larry.